Fox News Sunday host Chris fired back at Trump campaign advisor Steve as a conversation about last got heated. Oh yeah, I harangued him, said in a sarcastic tone, when accused him of forcing President Donald Trump to debate both him and Democratic presidential nominee. Recalled the fact that, despite rules at the Cleveland Clinic where it was held, members of the Trump family and White House Chief of Staff Mark Meadows chose to remove their masks during the event. Do they think that the health and safety rules for everybody else do not apply to them? Asked. Explained that everyone had been tested prior to the event, but pushed back saying that the rules had not been dependent on testing. So forget this question of being tested before, continued as tried to cut in. No, I'm going to finish my question. Everybody was told to wear a mask. Why did the first family and the chief of staff feel that the rules for everybody else didn't apply to them? pushed back, saying that the president supported the use of masks, but also valued the freedom of choice, arguing again that the people present at the debate had all been tested and had kept distance between the seats. They broke the rules, said again. I was there like you were, began. Why did they break the rules, asked again. It doesn't matter. Steve, the rules from the Cleveland Clinic, the rules from the Cleveland Clinic where everybody wears a mask, why didn't they? The way you are starting to harangue me now actually reminds me of what you did to the president during the debate on Tuesday night, replied. Oh, yeah, I harangued him, said. He had to debate, not just comma, but you as well. You are not a neutral moderator, argued, adding, I don't mind tough questions. But what I don't think is okay is for you to become the effective opposition to the president. Okay. And everyone there was tested in the crowd. They were distanced from each other. People can make Steve. Let me just say the president interrupted me, and the vice president 145 times, so I object to you saying, I harangue the president. I know it's the talking point, concluded, noting that the debate commission had said that anyone refusing to wear a mask at future events would be escorted from the hall.